Some people who've watched another video that I made on this channel about how to snake a toilet using an auger also asked me to do a video showing how to use a plunger. So I'm going to do that right now. I have two different kinds of plungers here that I wanted to show you. The one on the left is one I've had for a long, long time, and it has this piece that folds out that's supposed to go into the bottom of the toilet. Now the thing about this one was it started to get really stiff and hard to use. So I went to the hardware store and I talked to the guy about the different kinds they had and I bought another one just like it but brand new. So I thought, oh well because it's not old, it's brand new, it'll be easier to use. But it wasn't. This rubber part was really stiff. And I brought it back to the store and three men who were there said, oh you're right, it's really stiff, it's too hard to use. So they sold me this one. So this one's a little more pliable. So I suggest that you go to the store and look at what they have. And also this one on your right, you'll notice when I press it down, it has some suction. See that? I hope you heard that. Um, so that's this one on the right is the one I'm going to use, and I'm going to show you that next. My toilet isn't blocked right now, and the water level is at the regular level. But before you start, if the water level has gone way down, you'll need to flush the toilet once and um, get some water in there. Hopefully it doesn't overflow. Now I'm putting my arm in front of here. Um, another thing that I do, I use a cloth that I fold several times on top of the handle. This handle happens to be plastic. Some of them are wooden. But just to make it easier on my hand, I put um, this cloth on the end. So, you flush the toilet, get more water in there. Well, it's going to go down. So, but let's say it was backed up, so now it's, it's filling up, filling up. So what you want to do is get the plunger around the edge, and I'm using my cloth on top here, and I'm just going to push down. Okay, get some suction. And it, I really do prefer the auger to this, but sometimes you'll get the auger so far and then it's still not clear, and if you just give it a few good plunges with the plunger, it will finish off the project of getting everything through. So the idea is that this plunger, you want it to have some suction, and so that's why I suggest getting one that's more pliable like this. And the thing is it needs to have water in the toilet in order to plunge. All right? And a few plunges of that, the auger being my favorite choice, and you're pretty good to go. So get yourself a decent um, plunger. If you don't have any stores around you that have one, look online. And um, But hopefully you have some stores that have some choices. And even put it on the ground at the store like I showed you on my floor to make sure that it's easy to work. All right? Thanks for watching.